Innovation is at the hub of powder metallurgy manufacturing advancements in the automotive market. PM materials and consolidation processes are utilized to support the most demanding applications. Transmissions, engines, and chassis rely on performance components to provide durability and consistency. It is with great pleasure that the Metal Powder Industries Federation announces the winners of the 2020 Powder Metallurgy Design Excellence Awards competition in the automotive market segment. We will begin with the awards of distinction. Nichols Portland LLC has won an award of distinction in the automotive engine category for conventional PM components. This award-winning component is for a variable displacement vein pump rotor used in an automotive engine lubrication system. The three-level part possesses numerous critical tolerance features achieved with minimal secondary operations. Secondary operations include grinding of the rotor height, the hub diameter, and deburring. The 325 nanometer torque requirement for the FN0205 nickel steel part necessitated a minimum density of seven grams per cubic centimeter. The PM process characteristically produces a high bearing ratio plateau surface topography, making it highly desirable for sliding wear applications where low peak roughness is necessary to minimize wear over the service life of the device. MPP has won an award of distinction in the automotive engine category for conventional PM components. This award-winning high-strength camshaft bearing cap is made using a powder metallurgy aluminum copper magnesium alloy. Sizing ensures the part will meet the exacting tolerances required for installation in the engine without any machining. The bearing cap has an ultimate tensile strength of 320 megapascals, yield strength of 300 megapascals, and a fatigue strength of 90 megapascals. The PM aluminum cam caps match the thermal expansion of the cast aluminum heads and the porosity of the PM part enhances the lubrication of the camshaft. The machinability of the PM aluminum alloy closely matches that of the cast aluminum heads, permitting consistent line boring prior to the installation of the camshaft. The aluminum powder used to make this component contains a high level of recycled material. Indomim Private Limited has won an award of distinction in the automotive engine category for MIM components. This award-winning component is for three MinFlow setting devices used in the turbocharger of an automobile. The parts are made using MIM 316L stainless steel with a tunnel gate and four parts per shot. The parts are oriented horizontally in the mold and most of the part is formed in the core while the camphor is formed in the cavity. Double lining cooling channels provide optimum cooling. This helps reduce the sink and void in the thickest portion of the part where coring was not acceptable. Debinding was a challenge in the thickest section of the parts and controlling the perpendicularity in the L section during sintering was another challenge solved by sintering on part specific ceramic trays. The MIM parts replaced components that were machined in multiple steps. Allied Sinterings Incorporated has won an award of distinction in the automotive transmission category for conventional PM components. This award-winning component is a sear pin assembly. The part is used in a shift-by-wire automotive transmission actuator that causes an output shaft to rotate the sear pin, allowing a pawl to engage a default to part during a catastrophic transmission failure. The sear pin assembly consists of two discrete components, the pin and the flag. The pin is made using FC0208 copper steel and is pressed to a green density of 6.8 grams per cubic centimeter. The flag is made using FN0208 nickel steel and is pressed to a green density of 6.9 grams per cubic centimeter. The copper steel pin grows during sintering while the nickel steel flag shrinks. A push-out force minimum of 445 newtons can be maintained easily. The key challenge is the length of the pin, requiring a long powder fill in a thin section during compaction. The part is sintered at 1150 degrees Celsius and consequently heat treated via oil quenching and tempering prior to oil impregnation. The pin and flag have a micro indentation hardness 
equivalent to 60 HRC and 57 HRC respectively. Indomim Private Limited has won an award of distinction in the automotive transmission category for MIM components. This award-winning component is a park lock lever manual override used in a vehicle handbrake. Made in a two-cavity mold using MIM 4605 low alloy steel and centered on part-specific ceramic trays, the part replaced a machined component. The MIM part is heat treated, has a density of 7.5 grams per cubic centimeter, an ultimate tensile strength of 1550 megapascals, and an apparent hardness of 35 HRC. Indomim Private Limited has won an award of distinction in the automotive chassis category for MIM components. These award-winning components are left and right-hand side cable guides used in an automobile roof assembly. The MIM parts are made in a two-cavity mold and replaced expensive machined components. The MIM parts are made using MIM 4605 low alloy steel, have a density of 7.5 grams per cubic centimeter, and are heat treated to an apparent hardness of 35 HRC. They have an ultimate tensile strength of 1550 megapascals. As the parts are in constant exposure to the environment, they need to be corrosion resistant and have a low friction coefficient. They therefore undergo a zinc nickel coating process in a secondary operation. And now, the grand prize winning components. Core Wright Taiwan Company Limited has won a grand prize in the automotive engine category for conventional PM components with customer Schaeffler Technologies AG and company KG. This award-winning component is a variable valve timing sprocket used in a new generation electric variable valve timing design that integrates a sprocket with a stator and the function of the internal rotor is provided by the gearbox. The unique two-segment sprocket design is compacted using two upper punches, four lower punches, and two stepped core rods. Groove cutting and tooth deburring take place prior to induction hardening of the sprocket teeth. The inner diameter is machined after induction hardening. PMG Indiana Corporation has won a grand prize in the automotive transmission category for conventional PM components with customer FCA US LLC. This award-winning component is a torque converter one-way clutch stator assembly used in an eight-speed transmission. In the locked position, the part is subjected to a 350 nanometer torque. Traditionally, the races are manufactured from wrought steel or powder forged and case hardened to handle the high stress. The internal active form of the PM race is surface densified to a minimum density 7.8 grams per cubic centimeter and the overall part has a density of 7.35 grams per cubic centimeter. The parts are carburized, quenched, and tempered to achieve an apparent hardness at the surface of 58 to 62 HRC with a minimum core apparent hardness of 20 HRC. The parts are subsequently double disc ground. The complex internal geometry of the outer race consists of nine pockets. Each pocket is defined by a spring support surface, transitioning along a hook area to the active load-bearing cam surface, and contained between legs that extend radially inward. A surface roughness profile of better than 0.8 microns is achieved. Philips Metasize Metal Injection Molding has won a grand prize in the automotive transmission category for MIM components. This award-winning component is an actuator arm used in a nine-speed forward transmission assembly. The actuator arm is part of a patented selectable one-way clutch that replaces the reverse clutch. The part is formed in a four-cavity mold. It is made using two weight percent nickel steel with 0.40 to 0.65 weight percent carbon and has density of 7.5 grams per cubic centimeter a heat-treated hardness of 48 to 58 HRC, and a tensile strength of 1200 megapascals. A support rib was added to the shaft to carry the part through debinding and sintering. The support rib is subsequently machined off in an automated machining cell. Other secondary operations include tumbling and coating with a dry-to-touch corrosion inhibitor. 
Parts are 100% inspected using eddy current to check hardness, resonance testing, and part feature measurement verification. Congratulations to this year's Powder Metallurgy Design Excellence Awards winners.